Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we will learn how to install .run file in any Linux distribution. It is going to be a short and an informative video, so please watch till end. And if you like the video, please do not forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and press the notification bell. So without wasting the time, let's jump right into the video. Alright guys, as you can see inside my downloads directory, I am having a XAMPP, okay? This is uh, used for a PHP server, but it is an actually installer which is having an extension of .run. So how can we actually install it in Linux? So there are two methods. The first method is a graphical method and the second method is a terminal method to install .run file in Linux distribution. So first we are going to see how can we install the .run file via graphical method. So what you actually need to do is you need to click or right click on the dot run file, click on properties and over here you need to come to permissions and over here you need to come to the access and no sorry double click okay so you can see the program over here we need to allow this file to run as program it will be unchecked just check it out and click on close and now you can double click on the dot run file and it should start sometimes what happens this method is not going to work so if this method doesn't work for you you can go with the second method that is the terminal method and that works with every single file that is having an extension dot run so as you can see there has been an error to install this file via graphical method so how can we install with terminal method so for that we're going to come inside our terminal and where our file is actually located So my file is located inside my downloads directory and as you can see this is the file xamp linux x64 installer.run So first what we need to do over here is that we need to write chmod plus x and your file name So this is my file name I'm going to write that and press enter That's it Now there's the second step Second step is to write dot forward slash and the file name But this is not going to work because you need to have a root permission. So for having a root permission, you need to go with sudo dot slash and your file name and press enter. And now you need to enter your Linux distribution password. Once you do that, press enter. And now the XAMPP installer run file will start. Here is Zoe. Come Zoe. Here she is. Her name is Zoe. Zoe say hi. Hi. <laughs> Alright guys. So now Zoe is also going to program with me. Alright. So now as you can see the dot run file has started. Now what you need to do is you need to click on forward. Forward. Click on forward. And click on forward. That's it. The installation will start. So this is how you can install any kind of dot run file via terminal or via graphical method. If the graphical method is not working for you, you can go with the terminal method and that works for every kind of run files. As you can see, it's finished installing. So let's wait. For some time. Here is Zoe and now I will introduce you to my Jax. Alright, till the time it's installing. Alright Jax. Jax, come here. Come here, Jaxie. Yeah. Here you go. Here is Jax. Jax, say hi to the viewers. Hello. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so this was Zoe and Jax. Okay, so this is how it's going to be installing. It's gonna take some time depending on your distribution. So I have installed it in an actual a virtual machine, so it is a bit slow. So that's why it is taking time. So I think so the installation is complete. Let me check this thing out. Let me come over here and let me see the ZAMP is not there. But for starting the ZAMP, we need to come to the terminal. 
let me just try this thing out let me open a new terminal window and for starting sudo slash opt slash lamp start let me enter the password all right guys so it is starting my apache and my sequence in my pro ftpd all right guys so as you can see all are okay everything is started so that means my xamp server is successfully installed so this is how to install dot run file in your linux distribution all right guys that's it for this video if you like the video please do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and press the notification bell for more amazing video like this till then peace